With its immense popularity, it's hard to believe that Skyrim was released over 10 years ago. Since it dropped, the game has entertained many with its huge open world and gripping story. But for those looking for a new adventure, today on Game Rant, we want to go over the best games to play if you like Skyrim. At number one, we have the RPG that shook the world mid last year, Baldur's Gate 3. Now, to be fair, these two games aren't that similar. While Skyrim is a first person adventure that places you right in the action, Baldur's Gate offers something slower paced and more strategic. Based on Dungeons and Dragons, this title is more about planning your attacks and optimizing team synergy. It's turn based, and the battles can be difficult right out the gate if you don't understand the core mechanics. Where Skyrim and Baldur's Gate share the most similarities are in their deep stories. Like Skyrim, customization is everything in this game. There is no set path for you to follow, and the world is shaped by your decisions. So if feeling like the main character was your thing in Skyrim, you'll definitely enjoy yourself here. Next up is Cyberpunk 2077. Think of this like Skyrim, but in a dark dystopian future. You play as V, a mercenary who's just trying to make it in the ruthless area of Night City. Customization is huge and extremely fun in this title. But instead of relying on magic to solve your problems, you have cyberware. With it, you can do anything from hacking and stunning your enemies to giving yourself blades in your arms. As for the environment, Skyrim fans will be happy to know that Night City is dense with content. There is so much to do that following the story will become an afterthought. That's not to say that the main story isn't fun, but trust me, you'll be too busy trying to turn yourself into the ultimate cybernetic warrior before you complete it. Moving on, we have Elden Ring. From Software's latest title is their most ambitious one yet. In it, you take on the role of a Tarnished, one of a group of exiles from the Lands Between. Your mission? Repair the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord. Those who loved creating their own character in Skyrim will be happy to know that this title offers a character creator that is just as robust. You're also given multiple means to take on your enemies, which only adds to your freedom. For all my explorers out there, the Lands Between is not only huge, but also somewhat matches the aesthetic of Skyrim. However, we do have to warn you that combat in Elden Ring can be a lot harder. I mean, it is a From Software title. But once you get the hang of things, beating on all the otherworldly enemies will feel oh so satisfying. This next pick is a personal favorite of mine, The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Made by the same guys who brought us Cyberpunk, The Witcher 3 is revered as one of the best open world RPGs of all time, and it's for good reason. Geralt is an incredible protagonist, the combat system is extremely fun to learn, the story, especially the side stories, are just top notch. Heck, there's even a minigame in it that's so good, it became its own thing. Admittedly, the map is not as open as Skyrim since the world expands as you progress through the main plot, but with how much optional content you get, that won't even be a problem. And for our last pick, we're going with a title from a classic open world RPG series, Fallout 4. For those looking for something identical to Skyrim, but in a different environment, this one is just for you. Fallout takes you into a post-apocalyptic future where you must explore the barren wasteland of the Commonwealth to find your son. However, like many of the titles on this list, you'll most likely find yourself procrastinating and taking on the many things the open world has to offer. Combat is very interesting in this game due to all the unique weapons you can collect. You even get your own battle suit for those real difficult situations. And like Skyrim, you'll never run out of new mods to try. But that's about it for our list. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time.